Hey friends, I have an assortment of school books to show you that I'm gonna have for sale this week. So these are all vintage and antique textbooks. So this is most of what I have. I've probably forgotten to put a few things in, so you'll probably see more on the actual sale day, but I wanted to give you guys a chance to check all of these out, especially since they're old and some of them have some heavy wear. So enjoy. Okay, the Federal Union and the American Nation. This is a two volume set. A history of the US from 1865 to present and it's got some webbing showing. And the Federal Union is a history of the United States till 1865. Color maps, beautiful set. Next, Winter Comes and Goes. This is a science uh, reader. So all kinds of things on science and nature, trees and birds and the seasons and such. I love that one. Homelands, America's Old World Backgrounds. Cathedral Basic Readers, book six. This one's very pretty. Youthful Patriots of Colonial Times, Christmas, The Shrine, James Cardinal Gibbons. Very pretty, very, very pretty. Boys and Girls at School. This little page is missing. This one is just perfect. This is a primer. You can see there's a little rip there. And uh, there's a rip here, but it's just so pretty. Oh my gosh, love that one. This is a Elson Reader book three. I've never seen this binding before, so this just looks like a standard like heavy duty library binding. Some taped pages in this one. The Clown and the Farmer. This is Engine Whistles. This is an Alice and Jerry book. I also have a set of Engine Whistles and uh, whatever the other one is that goes along with it. I don't remember right now. This is 1942. Alrighty, let's see. This is called Bright Peaks. Houghton Mifflin from 1953. Holiday, Panorama, New World, and Prospecting. This looks like um, late elementary, early middle, maybe. I've never seen this one before, so I thought it was pretty cool. Caught in his own trap. This one is a cool and amazingly illustrated um, Spanish primer. Look at that picture. Isn't it amazing? Oh, it's just darling. Ah, love it. This is a very written on prose and poetry. This is uh, Betty Lou's old school book and she wanted you to know it, Betty Lou Fields. So Betty Lou Fields plus whoever the lucky boy was. Uh, more scribbles, but then inside she didn't take many notes, so maybe she was too busy daydreaming about H.A.B. This is Songs for Juniors. This is a nice old um, music book. This is uh, church music, so must have been used in a church setting. Hoping to get to the last page. There it is. Yeah. All right. Let's see. This is Adventures and Appreciation. This is the Laureate edition. I love these English books. They're very, very nice. And I've sold quite a few of these to homeschoolers. Really good foundational books. And really pretty, too. Okay. Here's one of the Elson Gray basic readers I have. This is book six. have so many of these it was hard for me to keep up with which ones were which. This is Sharing Adventures. This is called the Macmillan Readers. The Tenth Birthday, The Thinker. The 
cardboard castle. Looks like there's some good ones in there. Next, here's that set of two Alice and Jerry's with engine whistles and singing wheels. Singing wheels was the other one, so I'll show you singing wheels. There we go. So I'm selling those two together. Then this is engine whistles, another copy I have of engine whistles, but a different binding. I love in these books, all these little illustrations they have on the bottom of all different kinds of things. They're just really fun. Things used by watchmen and firemen, arrowheads, knife, whistles, or look at the furniture. Sofa, more whatnot, that's cute. And let's see what else I have. This looks like an old history book, ancient times. Yeah, ancient world from the earliest times to 800 AD. This is from 1913. Color maps. Better English introductory book. Talking about dogs. Was and were, speaking from dictation, learning to telephone, get of rid, it, rid of ands not needed. Winter fun. So that's more of a grammar book. This is Elson Reader book five. It's pretty damaged here on the spine. And you can see the webbing. This is Treasure Trails, Heights and Highways. This looks like five and six, grades five and six. This is one of my favorites. I just love the illustration style. Isn't it beautiful? There sat the schoolmaster fallen fast asleep. The brown marsh hawk. It was a slim brown horse. Next, I have a French book, French for Reading and Knowledge, textbook issued a Supply and Fiscal Department of U.S. Navy Postgraduate School, Monterey, California. This is a beauty, Fact and Story Readers, book four. Harvey took one of the books from the shelf. And then I have a set of three Alice and Jerry's engine whistles, singing wheels, and roundabout. So roundabout is the earliest one for the big beginner readers, and then it goes up from there. So all three of those I'm selling. And then one more Elson Gray basic reader book three. And that's that.